guys. I'm kind of driving around Samaria and I had some things to do here. And as I mentioned yesterday from the old city of Jerusalem, when I was breaking into the churches and we were having a blast together that I'm gonna to try to give some food out and some drinks to some IDF warriors. And that's exactly what we did. I drove up to this amazing falafel stand. We bought the falafel and Cokes and the fries. And I got a group of guys that I think are coming back from patrol now. So I pulled over and I think they know that I'm Israeli. So <laughs> not to do anything bad to me because, you know, these guys are on real combat patrol. So let me just lower this for a second. And I'm just going to pull up one second here. There we go. There we go. What's up, boys? Uh, Manishma. Manishma. How are you doing? How are you guys doing? That's beautiful. It's really nice to see you guys. I, I uh, was driving around and I knew I wanted to meet some IDF soldiers and show the world how amazing you guys are and also show the world how it doesn't hurt just to like give a few cokes and smile. Thank you so much. And to give some Thank falafels you. over and smile. Oh, man. And to give some french fries as you guys lovingly call them, chips. <laughs> over and smile and don't forget this there's one more listen boys i don't know how many you guys are and i don't need to know on film but there's seven falafels in there there's seven fries there's seven drinks because seven's a beautiful lucky number wishing you guys a beautiful day i think everybody in america and australia and canada and no matter where you are i'm sure you want to say hello to these guys so guys say hello to them how you doing people thank you so much thank for your you. support just the fact that we know that you guys are even thinking about us gives us motivation to keep on going every day and day I uh, really appreciate everything. And Ben Goldstein over here, he's a man. Um, literally just passed by and just popped us up with some, uh, some falafels. It just made our week. Man, as you know, I, as I told you guys, I, I don't like to sneak up on combat soldiers. So I kind of waved them down and told them what my name is and that I'm coming here to give them some good food. And uh, all I can tell you is it's sometimes the little things that matter. So God bless you guys. You're the heroes of all of the people watching this. We love you and we support you. I don't want to bother you any longer, but everybody here, if you just want to take one second, all of you watching, just take the next 10, five seconds with me and just give them a big prayer. No matter where you are, take five seconds and pray for the warriors of Israel, the modern Maccabees, the modern Giburim of King David. God bless you guys. Much love from Israel. Thank you. We can't wait to see you guys here so we can introduce you to the soldiers face to face. <laughs> Bye, boys. What a gorgeous area. I'm going to pull over for a second. <clears throat> Let me just pull over here. Just so I can show you this area. It's just magnificent. One second. Check it out. Look how beautiful it is here. Isn't that gorgeous? Just magnificent. So I thought that was kind of cool. And I mean, I'm not close to my house by any means. It took me a good hour and a half with traffic to get here. But that's exactly what we do as Unity Warriors. We do everything in our power to make sure that the soldiers of Israel, the heroes of Israel, the lone soldiers of Israel, the security services, the paramedics, and you, and the people that want to learn Torah, everything. That we go out of our way to make sure that we satisfy the needs, fill in the gaps, and spread the light of Israel. Much love. Have a great day. Thanks for watching.